In this video, I am going to show you how to trade with the RSI and the trend line by using the trend line. Now, this is the end software giving the Allies Blue commodity. So, here I am going to explain how to trade in a, with the RSI. This is the crude oil chart. I am taking the one hour chart and 60 days data. Now I'm going to add the RSI relative strand index here and the uh, HM annual period 14 and overall 70 zone and overall 30 zone using red color here applying here is the RSI and now we are going to discuss how to trade with the RSI by using the trend line. So, first the uh, one we will see that the trend line. What is the trend? Suppose this is the uh, supporting zone I am drawing here. Again, I am going to do a supporting line with uh, RSI. So, first support here, second support here. I am adding this trend line. So, let us see it is breaking down or not. If a bot above the price when the price are break down the uh, supporting zone we are going to take sell and togetherly RSI supporting should be break down so here we have seen in this candle is breaking down both of them here is the trend line is break down by this one RSI in the above uh, near to 70 zone and here is the trend line breaking by the price so which is our entry point is here so I we enter here in the market this is our entry point for sell and here is the and next time where we will exist in the market so first time we have seen this one the um, supporting zone uh, so we resist now here and we are adding a trend line here so connecting to them next time they are forming here we are adding here the supporting zone which is resistant and let's see in the what happened in the RSI yeah we are connect to the RSI first time we have seen in the RSI is able to break that this RSI trend line, which is the resistance zone is break down, but in the trend line is not able to break down here. So we are not going to close the our position here. Next we got the another supporting zone is a big uh, resistance. Here also same, it's not able to break down previous zone. And now we are going to add another resistance here. Here, little more they try to break down that level that uh, uh, very far from the upper resistance, so we are not going to close our level. Next, we got here another one resistant. Here is the big resistant over here, it's a resistant, it's not able to break down the area, it's a resistance, it's not able to break down area. But here is breakdown. Here is the resistance has broken down by the RSI, and the same thing is breaking the price also here. So we have to come out from the market, and this is again our entry point. So if we enter in the market, we got the first swing point and low swing point are here. So we are connected the swing point above them here both of them we bought some thing here so he, according to this one he is breaking down here so let's see it's, it's a lower point here we find it we are going to connect a lower point here and lower point here yeah here we can see here is another point but here is break down by the RSI this trend line but it's not 
able to break down the trend line. So we are not going to uh, close our order here. And now we can see here again they form the another point here. So we are going to add the another one. Yeah. Here is the breakdown by the trend line by the RSI. Here is breaking down the price is breaking down so we have to come out from the market we have to book here and we can take a sell here also because it's the last marketing uh, market closing time so we are not going to take any position so next time we are going to draw another supporting zone here in the next day it's the last closing price are here again they have formed that another one swing point and here let we can see here is again they are both have breaking the price we can take a buy risk if we bought something in this here if you bought something here in this price level so we have to draw again trend line this is the last trend line point is the last swimming point swimming point swing point swing point this one same thing again we are going to draw in the same RSI this was I am connecting the swing point. There is a one, two, three swing point are there, and here we can see is it breaking down or not? Yes, he is breaking down in this area. The price we can take sell here, or you can see that literally they are crossing the previous low. You can see here is price has break down the. Here we can going to take position here sell in this like again we can take a sell position here and next the market is come down again they gone little more up again they come down now we are going to connect the previous swing point here is the previous swing point market is come down again they are forming this one higher low and we are adding this one so next time we are going to add this one so you can see here price is breaking down but not able to break down we are not going to close the price I can come here and we enter here it's breaking down and then we are going to previous peak support in resistance are here you can see here if we enter here your our exit point here and again we are adding this one lower point here is the breakdown the lower point and let's see in RSI is able to break or not this one yes it is our sell point Yeah, from here we are getting the again sell signal here so we are going to sell here and what is the our exit point will we use just draw the previous swing point and connect here and you can see the previous swing point here yeah here which a previous swing point or swing close by this RSI but which a trend line is not able to break it's a very above from the price so we are not going to uh, come out from the market and market is again fell down and so next time we are getting again another swing point here and here here and the next we are going to connect another RSI swing point yeah here is the another bot RSI and price also moving so we are going to close our market and again we can enter in the market here